Hey, it's the Rod Traveler here again. Today's video is about something to do with traveling outside of the country. When you travel outside of your country and you'd like to use some of the resources back in your home country, especially through the internet, websites and the like quite often things are blocked or inaccessible when you leave your country and in order to get back into them in order to get through to certain websites and the like you will often need to use what's called a VPN a VPN is VPN is a virtual private network. There are different kinds of VPNs. There's free ones and there's paid for ones. But that's not the topic of this video. This video is how to check for a DNS leak in your VPN. So let's say you're in a different country. At the moment, I'm in the country of Canada. And as you can see on the page, I've got an IP address of 70.51.46.235 I will have a link to this page in the description of this video which is whatismyipaddress.com and it also shows you the provider it says where it is unfortunately this is not even correct it's Ville Saint Laurent not Ville Saint Laurent but whatever it's a, just a mistake it has the right uh, province and the right country and the location is correct so then I'm going to turn on my VPN I'm using I'm using tunnel bear which is in another one of my videos tunnel bear is a free VPN that you can download and I'm turning it on now and I set it to the United States as you can see I'm gonna go back to that what is my IP address page and I'm going to refresh the page and now as you can see the IP address has changed to 198.199.89.33 and now it's telling me that I'm on a digital ocean ISP I'm in the city of New York in the region of New York in the United States and there's a map and it's pointing to New York somewhere so that's proving to me that my VPN is doing its job, that it's actually switching my IP address. The rest of the internet will know me as being in New York right now. Now there's something called a DNS leak and a lot of VPNs have the issue or have a problem with v DNS leaks, which means they'll, they're going to actually leak out your uh, the name, the domain name server information which kind of contradicts having a VPN in the first place so I would do this before getting online and, and actually trusting a VPN is go to this site which is uh, dnsleaktest.com and as you can see this is what it was showing before this was my old IP that I had before and uh, I'm going to do a refresh on this page too. And as you can see, it's the same uh, information as we had on what is my IP address. 198, 199, 8933. 198, 199, 8933. From New York in the United States. So we can do the standard test here. And as you can see everything is pointing to the United States and I'm going to go back once more I'm going to do the extended test and as you can see again everything is pointing to the United States so that's it uh, hopefully this is a useful and helpful video for you 
I encourage you to use VPNs as often as you can. If you do travel, if you are a raw traveler, please uh, use this video to check for DNS leaks and let anybody else that travels know about it too. I'd really appreciate it and we'll see you soon on another